happy blessed people, happy blessed team, happy blessed believers of the living God. It's a new morning. It's morning in East Africa times, Rabbi. I have come here to help the people, to take people listen. Something that is related to Jesus Christ. This is the time we are. We are in the early times where all prophecies were prophesied by prophets of God, by prophets of God in more than 3,000 years ago, more than about 7,000 years ago. This is the time we are experiencing these prophecies. When I say prophets are lying, or the person or the people so called themselves as prophets, they are bringing something to make them fail. They are preaching something that will make them rich. They are, they are, even they can they cook miracles. They present fake miracles, convincing the congregants that this has come from God. One day, I attended Squan Church. I myself with my uncle. The moment we were requested as guests, as foreign guests, to enter into a specific room so that Pastor may come and greet us, give us hope, possibly to do miracle for us. My, my blood, when this TB Joshua came to our room, it was like someone with guns because my blood. Lands cold, you know. It's like someone scared has come to our room. When the pastor started greeting us, I, I was, you know, I was quiet. I was, I was one hundred percent quiet. Just I know him. Any movement he could make, I was looking at him because I would like to understand the nature of why I have feel feared. But I glorify God, he couldn't touch me. The people he touches, as he continued telling, giving us kind of hope, I walked out, you know. Mm -hmm. I told my uncle, my chest is not okay. Let me go walk out. The other people, my uncle, his wife and his children, I left them there while I was outside. Uh, my uncle was so much convinced he keeps attending the mass of the, not the mass, the service at the school. And the big problem I would like to tell you, something may not believe it. When my uncle, when we get back to Nairobi, uh, one day, one Sunday, my uncle said he's not feeling well now, he stopped attending this Squan church. And the big problem happens is that his children started acting weird, like they see something, like they see unseen entities in the house. When we call the Catholic priest to pray for, this, for these children, he said, these people, your children might, must have planted the spirit which is not from God. And the priest insists to know whether my uncle had attended certain service or certain religious church, a charismatic church. And uh, my uncle started, he weeps and weeps and weeps. He gave us to the, to the Catholic priest. What Catholic priest did, and uh, he woke up, he opened the Bible, he read, one of the, he read the book of Matthew, read the book of Joel, and read the book of Revelations. I recall this. After this, we all hold hands together and pray. After a Catholic priest left her home, and less than a month, the children in school, one of the child in the school, uh, collapsed on the second floor and died. He was buried. The other kid, the other kid I recall, a car hit him in a, in a road accident and uh, he died, you know. 
and cause wife. Uh, I recall one day they crashed with my uncle. And uh, on that same, same day, my aunt took poison. I mean, it, she died from taking poison. When my uncle realized now he has no wife, no children, the children has died. Now he's, he's like a single man, he's like a widow. Following day, we found the uncle died, you know. We found him in his bed. We thought he was sleeping, but his eyes were closed. The chapter was over. I, I tell you what we experienced in the heart of TB Joshua. So when I, tip, when I stay back and I think of these people, I feel cried, I mourn. Because these churches, you need to pray before you enter into these churches, not only TB Joshua. You recall the other person from South Africa, when he, he fixed someone to sleep on a coffin, then when the pastor appeared to him, pastor pretended like he's about to raise him from the dead. It is, it is evil. This diabolism, charismatic churches are many. Not only in Nigeria, they are many. When you start, when you put a finger on a Nigerian pastor or TB Joshua, remember many are behind and they are doing even more than this guy. God bless you for this me and have a wonderful time. Before you comment, please ask God to pay to give you the spirit of understanding so that the man in front of you to give to plant the spirit of God in you. Thank you so much.